Oh, wait a second. Can I do this to him? Oh, I can. Greetings, citations, you guys. It's Heater here. <laughs> I accidentally started a little early. I didn't change all my settings, but I think we're okay. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Welcome to another late night sale. I know I was going to do this a little bit earlier, like I said, but I wanted to go on tonight because I have some really great stuff for you guys. And I'm going to go try and go on earlier um, later on during this week. So, hi, Fox10, Mulder13. How's it going? How's everyone's what day doing today? How was everyone's week starting off? Any fun plans? Anything exciting? I'm just going to wait a few minutes and allow people to get in to the live chat. But I'm super duper excited. Uh, I have some really great stuff for you guys. And yes. <laughs> oh, man, I forgot my water. It's okay. If I die of dehydration, I apologize. Hi, Carol. How's it going? Clarice, yes, I did just start. I just got on. Hi, Tara. Hi, Bendum. Hi, Nurse Shay. Oh, Nurse Shay just woke up. Oh, my goodness. I hope I wasn't the one that woke you up. <laughs> Hi, Dina. Hi, Cat Cat Shop. How's it going? How you guys doing tonight? But, um, hi, Darlene. Yay. Hi, Sharon. Michelle. Oh, my goodness. I wonder if I can make this larger. <gasps> I can make this larger. How did I not know that? Now I can actually see the words. You learn something new every day. Okay, you guys. So I think we're gonna do today's sale just a little bit differently since I wanna try like kind of different things to make it a little bit easier. Is that a Fendi monster back there? <laughs> Dina, nothing gets past you, yes. Hi, Helen. Um, I'm doing this new thing where I'm using like the Fendi charms as pillow charms because I think they look super cute. So they're just like sitting here on my um, pillows because, you know, I have like a couple of them and I can't use them all at once. But if I have them like on my pillows, they're super duper cute. And I don't know, I feel like they're pretty fun. I just got this one. That's why it still has a tag on it. I was actually going to do a haul with it and I forgot to film the video. So um, still have to do that, <laughs> but I was just practicing. So I have a couple of them just sitting there. Hi, Mrs. Shelley. Hi, Ken. Hi, The Luminous You. Helen, all the way in Montreal, Canada. How's it going? Okay. I'm like trying to get comfortable. I'm like surrounded, like literally in a sea of handbags right now. So um, I'm going to... Should I start right now? It's okay. I'm, I think I'm going to start right now. But actually, first, how is everyone doing tonight? Hope you guys had a fantastic day. Um, today, uh, let me tell you a funny story. So I was packaging up some stuff today, and I was bringing the stuff into the car. And I had the front door open, and there's, like, this little... Okay, so in front of our front door, there's, like, this lantern light thing. And on top of the lantern, a bird has made a nest, and it's laid some eggs. So it's, like, always, like, right there. I opened the front door, and then I kept it open. I didn't actually close it. So then I guess, like, when I was walking back into the house, the bird, instead of flying out, flew into the house. And we were like running around like crazy people trying to get it for 30 minutes. So it was nuts. I actually oh, do I have a picture of the bird. It's 12.35 and I'm still up. <gasps> You're still awake, Chan. And there's snow. Oh my gosh, I love snow. Um, I don't know, Yen. Are you hitting like the little bell notification? And I think you have to turn it on to all, like to, to be notified at all times and not just some of the time. I think there's like differences on there for um the notifications and oh no your crown fell off <gasps> that actually just happened to my dad recently too so he had to go to the dentist to have his um crown put back in or fixed or something hi tosh hi pamela i, ha I have a photo of that bird um John actually was the one that caught it. Like we literally had to tire the bird out for like 30 minutes, which is like flying around. And John finally was able to grab the bird 
And there it is in his hand. We got to put it back outside so it could be with its little babies. And it's totally fine. When I got back home, it was back in its nest flying around. So luckily the bird's okay and everything's okay. The babies are going to be okay. And yeah, but it was just a little bit of um, a hot mess while we were just like running around trying to get the bird. But yeah, it's so cute though. Like the bird was adorable and we were just happy that we were able. Oh, this is the bird when it was being sassy. This is the bird when it was sassy on the stairs. Look at it. It was like mocking us, honestly. It was so crazy. <laughs> Look at its like a little stance, his little pose. Um, oh, the Luminous You. I wanted to ask you, at some stores you thrift for shoes, there's only one of each shoe. Do they give you the other if you decide to buy? Oh, yeah. Yes, the Luminous You. Um, so for the shoes that they have at the store that are like a little bit more expensive or like more higher end or whatever they deem designer, they will just put one shoe out. And then if you decide that you want to buy it, you bring it to the front and then you ask for the other pair. You can examine them first before you buy. And yeah, so I guess it like helps prevent theft or whatever. Plus it helps keep, um, it, it allows them also to put out more shoes since they have so, so many. So they only need like one shoe out per or for the pair and it's easier to find. Um, Odelia, thank you. Everyone's doing well. Sassy on the stairs, exactly. Pair of legal and fashion. That's exactly how it was. That little bird was like so crazy, but it was like exercise trying to get it. <laughs> And then mom was like, what is happening? There was like a ruckus. All the kids were like screaming. It was so funny. Exactly, Nurse <laughs> Okay, let's hop into the sale really quickly. I'm going to show you guys some things that I've already showed in other videos. And I'm also going to discount some items that I have in the shop already and um, show you guys those as well. But um, birds or dolls. I actually like birds. I love birds. We I grew up with birds in the house we used to have parakeets um cockatiels when we were younger we had these two giant like macaws at one point also so love birds but it's just like intense when one flies into your house and you can't get it and it's like literally pooping everywhere and <laughs> we were just like worried that it was like a mama bird and needed to take care of its babies so we were like oh my gosh like we have to make sure the bird is okay because its little babies are like out there like i think like they were like screaming you should have filmed it you know i <laughs> i was not thinking about filming at I did film it like momentarily, like once we were able to get the bird. So that'll be in um, a video coming up, like a vlog thing. So that'll be up if you guys want to watch that. Uh, right? Yeah, it was crazy. So it was very, yeah. The kids had a blast though. They were like, oh, the bird. They were really excited. And John luckily was able to grab it because it like was really tired and it flew like under. Um, like a little chair thing that the kids have and he was able to get it so and it's it was all safe and okay but okay um so today's sale is going to be a little bit different we're not doing the uh the invoices like we normally do i'm going to do it through depop so once i show you guys the item i have my va on the phone in my ear right now and when they hear that um i show you guys an item it'll be up for sale in the shop so down below in like the description box of this like if you guys haven't already been there it's the depop shop so um there's a link down there if you guys want or you can just hop on to your depop app and um see the items as they go live so as i show you the item at the end once I'm done showing you guys everything about it and give you the price, then it'll be for it'll be live in the shop and you can go ahead and purchase there. I uh, just wanted to try something a little bit different because um, it's a lot easier to make invoices and all that stuff through Depop and it's easier to just like keep everything in order and in check. So we're just trying something a little bit different. So bear with me. I'm trying to see like what works best. And um, there's also actually a sale right now going on on Depop. So if you guys see anything that you like in the shop, that's um, $30 or more, if you're within the US, you get free shipping. So you can um, take advantage of that sale as well. And that's going to end on April 23rd. 
So you have three days to go check that out for that sale. And I currently have everything 20% off in the shop as well. So you guys can get a good discount. Hi, Sally. Hi, Ronnie. So that's how that's going. Just in case you want the link for Depop, I'm going to pin it up at the top. And um, I don't think you can click on the link, but if you type it out, um, in your browser or just go on the Depop app, it'll bring you, um, it'll, you can go straight to the shop and see what I have. So there's no need to like say mine or anything. Um, as I show you guys the items, you can just go ahead to Depop um, and purchase. And it's like pretty much first come first serve, I guess. So hopefully it works out. <laughs> Uh, but hi, Elaine. Oh, I'm so happy you're here. Oh, I have a piece of paper stuck to my hand. Um, okay, so hi, Alicia. Let's start off with the first item. Um, up for grabs first is this beautiful Tory Burch bucket bag crossbody. Um, if you guys remember, I actually did a video on this, and I actually did like a color match on it. And um, I totally forgot that I even, like, had it. Like, after I worked on it, I, like, put it on my shelf with, like, my other handbags that I have. That <laughs> and I totally forgot to even put this in the shop. So now I have it available for you guys. Um, it's really, really cute. And it is, like, in such fantastic condition, especially after I repainted everything. It looks so beautiful. Um, there, the exterior leather is like in perfect condition. The interior is also equally fantastic. I don't know how open I can get it to go. Ooh. But just know that there's, um, no, there's no pen marks or anything inside. Everything is pretty much immaculate in there. There's one zipper pocket in the back, two open pockets, and I'm asking 120 for this one. So this one should be live, I think, in the shop. Let me just check to make sure. Thank you, Kelly. Yeah, I was, like, so excited to color match this bag. It was a challenge, but it was super-duper fun and one that I want to do more often. So... Really excited about that. Uh, I'll let you know once it goes live in the shop because I guess it hasn't gone up yet. Um, so this one, again, it's going to be 120. Fifty nine watching. Oh, thank you, Jean. You're so sweet. <laughs> But thank you for everyone that's coming on. I know, like, this, again, another random live. I didn't announce it at all. Uh, and... Yeah, so for all of you guys that always come up, thank you so much. Um, but the bag is now live in the shop. It's a screen grab of me holding it like this. So it's the very first thing on there, $120. Again, that's also including shipping and all that stuff. But for this beautiful Tory Burch bucket bag, it has the crossbody strap, which is removable and adjustable. And the bag is in fantastic, fantastic condition. So there you go. Beautiful. Okay, so that is our first item. I'm actually going to type this out so you guys will know the prices and stuff. Um, so if anyone is watching this after the live's already happened, just know that the I'm, I'm typing out the prices here in the live chat, but everything will also be in the shop. It's depop.com backslash it's Hadrian. And um, yes, it's now up in the shop, available for anyone who would like to purchase. Uh, first come, first serve. So just like if you want it, just go over there and you can check out. Um, but the first bag is the Tory Burch Brown Bucket Bag. And that is $120 shipped. All right. Okay, first item is done. Ooh, second item, I'm always going to show you guys this until it sells because I just love this wallet so much. This is that champagne colored metallic Chanel wallet. Gorgeous. I love this wallet so so much. It comes with a um it comes with a box and it has the fashion file dust bag inside. And it comes with all the authenticity cards and the um authentication card from Chanel. And all these things will come with it. This wallet is in fantastic shape. It's like a three-fourth size wallet. It has four card slots, and then it has the coin 
pocket right there, and little serial number is actually right there. But um, this one is four hundred and fifty dollars. So there it is. Uh, Bendem. Yes, the Tory Burch is already in the shop. This one will be up momentarily. I'm just waiting for uh, my VA to get it up. But it's four fifty for this one. It's four fifty. Item number two, metallic sham sham champagne champagne. Three fourths size wallet. Chanel four fifty. All right. Hi, Carmen. Thank you. I'm excited to show you guys, too, all the new stuff. Hi, Yolanda. How's it going? Uh, okay. So um, I'll let you know once the Chanel water is up, but the Tory Burch is up for grabs if anyone is interested. What do we have next? Okay. Up next, we have this beautiful... Kate Spade satchel. This one is beautiful. It's tricolor. So this uh, middle part is kind of like a cream off-white color. And then we have the periwinkle sides. And then the top handle is black as well as the um, crossbody strap. And then it has light gold hardware. So this one is beautiful. It's in a soft fiano leather. So that's means it's like scratch resistant, stain resistant, water resistant. And the interior is in great shape. Oh, there's a little dust ball in there. Yikes. But the interior is in great shape. This is that striped black and white fabric. There's an interior zipper pocket and then two open pockets right there. And then the top does zip closed as well. Right, Kelly? It's beautiful. And then there's also the little Kate Spade dongle right here. Um, also, I was just up updated. The Chanel wallet is up for sale now in the shop if anyone is interested. Um, this Kate Spade wallet, or Kate Spade bag, we're trying to get this one up right now as well. But it's beautiful, right? I love a Safiano leather. I love the structure of the bag. It does look new, Dolores. It looks fantastic. So this one um, is item number three. Kate Spade Try Color Satchel. And this one I am asking 105. I'll let you guys know once that is up as well. Okay, so that's item number three, Kate Spade Safiano Satchel. Oh, Carmen, you're still thinking about the blue Kate Spade. Wasn't it beautiful? I'm so happy that someone bought it. It's so pretty, and I love the color so, so much. Um, that one was definitely like a different style from this one. This one is definitely like more structured, a little bit more like, I feel like this one looks a little bit more formal. The other one looks a little more like, um, I don't know, like more whimsical because of like the scalloped edges and just like the general like construction and shape of the bag. It was like a little bit more minimal, but also a little bit more like going on at the same time, if that makes sense. I don't know, but really, really cute Kate Spade. Um, uh, what do we have next? And I'll let you know once that Kate Spade is up, but it's going to be $105 for that one. Then, what do I have next? Okay. Oh, okay. This one, this one's a good one. I love this bag so, so much. And it was such like a cool find. And this one is a beautiful Brahmin drawstring bucket bag. And the, the strap is a shoulder strap. You could add a longer strap to it if you wanted to carry it crossbody, but this one just has the one shorter like shoulder strap on it. But it's this beautiful kind of like I don't know, like smoky bluish gray color. And then it has the gold brushed hardware. It has a little Brahmin bow right there on the front. 
And then it has the little um, tassel right here that says Brahmin. This one was a really cool find because this one is a newer style of Brahmin that's come out. Um, they have just started, they, they recently within the past few years started doing like different types of leathers. I know they're, um, they usually do a lot of like the alligator or crocodile embossed leathers. But um, this one is one of the smooth leather ones, which is so, so pretty. Linda, yes. We're going to be doing a video on cleaning that bag very, very soon. I'm so excited about it. I love it. Um, that Kate Spade bag is now up. And it actually looks like it just sold. So yay to whoever bought it. Very exciting. Congratulations on the Kate Spade. It's such a beautiful bag. Um, but here we go. Brahmin. Let me show you guys the interior. This one also does come with the like registration card. So you can still register it and all that stuff online. And the interior is in pretty great shape. There is like a couple small, I can't even really show it, I think. There's a couple small pen mark, but like in the corners of the bag inside. Um, not very, not visible at all unless you look really, really hard, but there's a, uh, there's a zipper pocket right there. And then there's two open pockets down here. There is a little key fob as well. And this one, I am asking, let me look at my notes, 105 as well for this beautiful Brahmin in this smoky blue color. There's the back. There's the bottom, the corners. And this bag is in fantastic condition. Other than like this few tiny small pen marks in the interior, this bag is in really, really great pre-loved condition. So that is item number four, and that is Smoke Blue Brahmin Rostring Bucket Bag for 105 doll hairs. All right. Okay, so we have that. So, oh, we'll put this one up here since it's sold. That one's sold. Or maybe I should put the items that haven't sold up there. I feel like last time I did that, people were getting confused. So. We have the Brahmin, we have the Tory Birch, and we have the Chanel wallet right there. Right, Kelly? I'm really excited to do the video, too. I'm going to probably try and film it maybe tomorrow, and I'll have it up hopefully by the end of the week or early next week. It'll go up. Um... Ooh, I did want to show this bag again in case anyone's here that didn't see it last time. But I had this up in the other live I did from Sunday night. But this is a beautiful Marc Jacobs satchel. It's in this beautiful, like, glacier gray color with silver hardware. This one is in like new condition. It has the top handles and then has the removable crossbody strap. Zips all the way across the top. The interior has one zipper pocket in the back and then two open pockets right here in the front. Hi, Anne, how's it going? Um, this one I'm asking $150 for. And that's for this Marc Jacobs Glacier Gray. I'm gonna flip, that's the color I'm sticking with, Glacier Gray. I really like the name of that satchel. So that's item number five, Marc Jacobs Glacier Gray Satchel. And that is for a hundred and fifty. And if you're interested in anything, just go to um, my Depop shop, and you can go ahead and purchase. There's no like um, we're not doing any of the like uh, like mine or saying mine or whatever in the live chat. You can just go ahead and purchase on the website. Um, I'm having them go live as I show the items. So right now, everything is up with the exception of the mark by mark. That one will be up momentarily. Let me actually pin the website um, up top. I don't know if you can click on it, but I'll pin it. But you can just go to my Depop shop um, and go ahead and check out the items there. So I pinned it. It should be up at the top now. So, okay. Um, but the Brahmin is up now if anyone is interested in it, as well as everything else. 
Um, the Mark Jacobs will be up momentarily. And then what do we have next? Oh, let's do this. Okay. This one just looks a little dusty. I'm so sorry. But we have this beautiful Kate Spade. This is a uh, neoprene laptop bag by Kate Spade. It has leather trim, the top handles. It is missing the crossbody strap, though, but you can attach any crossbody strap to this. It'll be fun. I would do, like, a cool, like, printed guitar strap type deal. I think that would be really cool. And it'll be, like, nice on your... um on your shoulder or wherever when you decide to carry it. The inside is in this cool, like, geometric pattern. It has the laptop um, portion right there. And then it has two open pockets right at the top right here. One could be for your laptop charger. And the other one, like, if you have a MacBook that doesn't have the CD-ROM drive, you can stick that in there. So it's really, really cool. This will hold a 15-inch MacBook Pro. It is a great size. I feel like laptop bags by like, especially like um, designer ones, normally don't come in the like larger 15 inch size. It's usually only for like the 13 inch MacBook Pros. So that was a really exciting thing about this one. Um, has the light gold hardware. There's the back. There's the bottom. The bottom is also leather. There we go. Also, if anyone has any questions about anything, feel free to ask. Um, and also, feel free to shop in the store as well. Anything that's up in the store right now, if it's um, everything's already marked on sale, but things that are $30 or more will also receive free shipping right now. That's until the 23rd of this month. So, very exciting. But you know what? Since you guys are here, I'm going to give you guys an extra discount. And this is only for during this live. If you see anything else that you like in the shop, I'll give you guys an extra 10%. Just make sure to send me a DM on Depop and I'll mark it down for you. You can even, if you see anything right now, if you shop, um, I have my VA watching everything on there as well. So you guys can go Go ahead and send a message on there. And if you see anything, they'll mark it down for you an extra 10%. So if you see anything in the shop, extra 10% off. And um, but with the exception of these items that I'm showing you guys right now, these um, these items are just as priced. But anything else that's in the shop that's down there, go check it out. And we'll give you an extra 10% off. And then for that, free shipping is automatic as well for orders $30 or more. So, okay. <laughs> but here we have Kate Spade laptop bag. This one is will fit the 15-inch MacBook Pro. Uh, hi, Dolores. Hi, Sharon. Hi, everyone. Thank you guys for all joining in. I can't believe there's 92 of you guys. Ah, I love it. You guys make me so excited. I can't. Okay, this is item number six. Doo, doo, doo. And this is the Kate Spade Neoprene Neoprene Black Laptop Bag. And this one I am doing for uh, $75. Kate Spade Neoprene Black Laptop. Did I spell everything correctly? Yes, I did. Um, you want the the pink Michael Kors bag that's in the store right now. Oh, okay. Um, all right. My, uh, my, the, my VA will go ahead and discount that for you. I'll let you know once they do that. And actually, let me do it. I'm like right here. Um, it's the pink Michael Kors bag. Do I have a pink Michael Kors bag right now? Is it the plant? Is it the pink Mark Jacobs bag, maybe, or is it the um, is it this one right here, this like magenta colored one? You want the purple hunter? <laughs> you guys are so funny. I love that you guys are asking me. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and change the prices for you guys right now. Then, since like we are right here, um, we have <laughs> my poor VA is trying to discount or trying to list the other things still. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Um, let's do the purple hunter boots. Okay, the purple boots have been discounted 
Dolores, they are ready for you. Um, okay, yes, that's the Michael Kors bag. Hello, strangers. Okay, I will go ahead and discount that. So I have to do it manually. I know Depop's like kind of a hassle like that, so I apologize. But we'll mark that one down. And all right, that Michael Kors bag is all ready for you. Okay. <laughs> um, what do we have next? Okay, let's do this. Um, oh, okay. This one is such a gorgeous bag, you guys. I am like kind of obsessed. And this is a coach. I think this is called the Dreamers bag. And it's in this beautiful, like, it's like a brown, brownish with red undertones bag. It has a pebbled leather. And then the, it has like this um, kind of like inlay section that goes around that. And it's in a suede. It's so beautiful, you guys. This bag is stunning. It has the brushed gold hardware. It has the top handles. It has the removable and adjustable crossbody strap. And this bag has, like, so many amazing compartments, too. So there is a front compartment right here. It has the magnetic snap. There's another one right here at the back. Sorry, I'm, like, struggling. <laughs> There's another one here at the back as well. And the middle has the zippered pocket, which has um, one back zippered pocket right there. And there's one right here in the front. You're right, darling, this bag is stunning. Uh, it also does come with like the original care cards as well. Um, this bag, it's called the Coach Dreamer bag. And it retailed for $695. Like this bag was like, Wow, it's amazing. Yes, the dreamer. And it looks like a dream. Like, I love the name. It's so beautiful. Um, this one, I'm asking $250. This bag is in pretty much like new condition. And it is a stunner. Like, this bag is... The studs all over it are just, like, everything. It has so many amazing details. I think my favorite part about this is probably the hardware. I love the way the hardware looks. Like, it's so cool. And then it even, has, it even says, like, coach on the little rings, which is awesome. So it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bag. I love it so much. Again, this is the Coach Dreamer. It retailed for $6.95. I'm asking $2.50 for it, and it's in, like, new condition. And it does come with the little care cards inside as well. Uh, it has, like, two little dongles. It has, like, the Coach C right there. And then it has the little dog tag. Oh, Tara, you do? Oh, I bet it's beautiful. What color is it in? Okay. Um, so let me... Okay, so that one is now live in the store, but let me just type it out so you guys have it right here in the chat as well. So item number seven, Coach Dreamer bag. And that one is 250 Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Um, oh, Dolores, you just bought the boots. Yay, thank you. Okay, so that is our item number seven for the evening. This beautiful Coach Dreamer bag. Uh, what a stunner. I love this bag so, so much. So pretty. Will it stand right here for me? It's like barely even in the frame. Um, okay. Um, but again, if anyone has any questions, let me know about anything. If you guys want to see anything a little bit more or have any questions about like sizing or anything like that, feel free to ask the signature print, the collab with the Chelsea Chaplin and Skull on the front. <gasps> Ooh, that sounds beautiful. I'm going to have to look that up later, later, Tara. I love like anything like with a good skull print. It reminds me of like Alexander McQueen. That's why I love Alexander McQueen so much beautiful congratulations on that beautiful bag okay um what do we have next okay up next um uh, we have this bag right here let me actually oh it fell don't fall coach okay up next we have this dooney and burke um this is like the Florentine toggle crossbody bag. This is in a red color. 
It's like it has like it's orangey red or reddish. Well, yeah, orangey red. <laughs> but it's beautiful. It has the crossbody strap right here. You can actually adjust the crossbody strap also to be a shoulder strap. So you can have it sh uh, shorter as well if you wanted. There is a one back zipper pocket. The toggle opens up like this. And in the interior, we have um, the zipper pocket in the inside. And then we have three open pockets. I don't know if that's showing up. And then um, there's the key fob as well. For this one, I am asking $75. This one, this little bag is just like falling over the hardware. It's so heavy. It's okay. Um, so I'm asking $75 for this one. Beautiful. It has a little bit of like darkening on the corners but that's what happens with this like the florentine leather it just starts to like patina over time so it just like takes on um like a more um like a more patina like not age but like the patina like it darkens and lightens so it just grows with you over time and changes and that's what's beautiful about this type of leather the florentine leather is so so pretty so red coach toggle bag this is item number eight wait did i say coach red dooney and burke red dooney and burke toggle crossbody bag And this one is 75. All right. So that is right there. Oh, you have the, it's the smaller size, Tara. How much smaller is the smaller one? I feel like this one is a really good size. Like this is like a good, this is like a good medium size. I think this is like the, the 36 size. So I don't know why I keep showing it, but it's such a pretty bag. Like I love it so much. Um, okay. What do we have next? I want to be like right here. Okay. <laughs> what do we have next? Oh, here. It's a bag charm. I don't know why I call it a dongle. It's like something crazy that I always say, even though it's a bag charm. Yes. <laughs> Hi, April. I'm well. How are you doing tonight? Thank you for joining us tonight. Uh, so up next, this is item number nine, is the Coach crossbody bag. This one is super duper cute. It's vintage. This one is uh, made in USA in that black, gorgeous, supple, vintage leather with the brass hardware really fun this is kind of like um it, it's kind of reminds me of the like phone bags that are really popular right now you can definitely put your iphone in there perfectly and this is like the largest phone from apple so that will fit inside beautifully there's a front pocket right in here and then just like the main compartment inside the interior of the bag is just that um, the rough suede of the underside of the exterior leather. So beautiful. Then it has a crossbody strap as well. And if you want to shorten it, you can kind of just like tie a little knot with it if you wanted. But it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful vintage crossbody bag. Um, this style is super duper rare. I have never seen this one in the wild before. So I'm very excited to have found it. And I'm asking $75 for this beauty. Oh my gosh, April, it's 1 a.m. I need to start doing these earlier. I always feel bad when you guys tell me how late it is in your neck of the woods. Here it is 10, 10 a.m. My gosh, I think my mom had that back when, ugh. right, Kelly? Back when it wasn't vintage yet. Like this bag is probably, I want to say like around maybe even 30 years old, even more. So such a gorgeous bag. Black coach crossbody bag so that is item number nine black vintage coach we're just gonna call it phone bag even though it wasn't for phones because they didn't have phones like cellular phones back then but that's just what we're gonna call it because it's like that size 
um, on, on the East Coast, but I stay up late. I enjoy these later live streams. He oh, thank you, Anne. I'm so glad you enjoy them. Oh, right, Fox and Mulder. It's so amazing that you are able to find these bags of thrift. It makes you wonder who would part with them. Some of them practically new, right? Like, it's crazy how people will um, part with their handbags. I'm like, no, never. Though I do find um, a lot of these bags were actually from, um, from like, consignment stores and stuff. So I did have to pay up for them, for, uh, for some of them. But it's still crazy. I found a Balenciaga for $40 at a thrift store. It was real. <gasps> and congratulations. That's amazing. I love Balenciaga bags. Um, was it the Balenciaga, like the motorcycle bag with like the grot, like the, like all of the cool details and the, is that the Chanel bag you got in the background? Yes, it is. A it's right here. Just put it right there. Oh, the city bag. Yes. But, um, okay, what do we have next? Uh, again, if anyone, too, has any questions about anything or would like um, an item discounted in the shop um, that's not from today's live, just let me know. I'm going to give you guys an extra 10% off during um, this live sale. That's, uh, so just send a message or let me know right here in the live chat and I'll go ahead and discount those items for you. But so far, everything should already be loaded into um, the onto the app. Laura, hi. It's okay, Laura. We're only 41 minutes in. <laughs> you can always, oh, you guys can also always catch the um, the replay of the video as well. I'll just leave it up for you guys to check out. If you want to go back and look at anything in the videos, you can do that. Um, but for everyone that's joining, welcome. So happy to have you guys here. Welcome to my live late night QVC handbag sale. <laughs> Hi, Deborah. Good evening to you, Adrian. It's 110 in Cumberland. Maryland, great bags. Love myself with your Ferragamo. Oh, yay. I'm so glad you like your Ferragamo bag. That was a beautiful one. Wow. You got a you got an artsy and a celly for 700 total. You are so lucky. Like just an artsy is probably like it'll probably retail for like I think like normal retail for that is maybe over 1200. But the artsy is such a such a gorgeous bag. Um the Sully, I'm not too sure about the silhouette. I'm gonna have to look that one up. But I know the artsy, I love that bag. It's beautiful. It was a DC realtor lady who just wanted to pawn her stuff off really quickly. I wish I knew a DC realtor lady who wanted to pawn off her stuff really quickly. I would buy all her stuff in a heartbeat. Hi, LWS7818. How's it going? Thank you for joining our live sale tonight. Um, oh, I did want to show you guys this too. This was from, I think this was from Saturday's live. But I think this is like one of the um, items, like only one of the items that were left over from that sale but i love this bag so so much this is a kate spade striped tote it's in like this um like a light pink and then kind of like a salmony pinkish orangey color it has this really cute charm right here oh that's the back of the bag on the <laughs> there's this really cute charm with a little spade on it and the little bow and then it has like the kate spade right there with the little kate or the little spade um, charm thing on top of that. So this bag is in fantastic, like new condition. It has the Vachetta colored top handle. And then the interior is just this beautiful, beautiful opening. It has a zipper pocket right there, two open pockets. And then it has just a little clip closure to hold it closed. Right, Cactus Patch Girl? It's so cute. Anna Maria Hernandez Rodriguez. Hi, Hadrian. Destin, Mexico City. <gasps> Hi, Anna, all the way in Mexico City. How's it going? Melba and Nate Official. Hello. How's it going? Thank you for joining us today during our live sale. Uh, so this is... You know what? Let me check. Is it leather? It should say on the little thing right here. Um, show... No, it's not leather. The whole thing is uh, coated canvas, kind of like how like Louis Vuitton bags, how they're um, like the LVs. Those are coated canvas. This is um, 
just like that. So this is a coated canvas, though it has like the feel and look of like a like a leather coated canvas. So uh all right, so this one, how much did I have this one for? Do, 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 do. This one is $75. So this is item number uh, I think this is item number 10. Uh, yes, item number 10. Miss Shelly, I believe I've heard them called Dongle from Dooney and Burke. Yeah, they're, I don't, <laughs> they all have different names. <laughs> uh, okay, item number 10 is Kate Spade Stripe Pink Tote for $75. Again, if you would like to, if any of you guys would like to purchase anything that I'm showing you right now, you can just go ahead and check it out in my Depop shop. I have it. Um, pinned up at the top it's depop.com backslash it's hadrian or you can just access it from your depop app like normal um i also have the link to i think i have the link to the shop in my instagram do i it's also linked down below in the description box of this video if you guys want to go there to check it out as well oh yeah i do have the link for it on my instagram if you guys want to go check it out um April, but yeah, okay, so there's that. Kate Spade striped tote. Whew. Okay, uh, and, and again, if anyone has any questions, please let me know. Um, ooh, does anyone have any cool plans for this next weekend? Like, it has been the weather in California, at least where I live, has been totally outrageous. I cannot, like, it was. 90 like over 90 degrees this past weekend and then tomorrow it's supposed to be 63 degrees so like it went from 90 to 63 and then it's supposed to rain as well like i think it's supposed to rain tomorrow <laughs> which is nuts so we went from rain or from like super sunny weather to rain it is like crazy our california can't make up its mind with the weather but you know what we're gonna get through it okay um it's been the same in Houston, right? I feel like the weather has just been like a little nuts everywhere, which is so strange. Um, up next, we have this red Valentino tote. April, right? April, oh my gosh, that poor bird. I'm so happy it's okay too. But we have this red Valentino tote. The brand is uh, the brand is actually red Valentino. It's not like a red colored bag. The color of the bag is actually a, a like a nude color. The bow is so pretty. Linda does. Oh, you had snow showers on Tuesday. That's crazy. But um, yes, red Valentino tote. Oh my gosh, you guys, my leg is like falling asleep. <laughs> like uh, okay uh. anyway so there is a tote bag and it has the removable or not it's actually not removable it has a little pouch inside of here as well they so can um put your uh things that you want like easier access to so you're not digging through the bag uh, the interior of the bag is just the suede of the exterior of the leather. And, yeah, the bag is in really fantastic um, pre love condition. There's a little bit of darkening primarily on this corner right there. Can you see that? But other than that, the bag is in fantastic shape. It's so pretty. And this one I am asking uh, $80. So if anyone is interested, this one will be up in the shop for $80. Beautiful red Valentino tote bag with a super cute bow. And this one is already in the shop. Um, so if you would like to purchase, just let me know. Because um, I think this was already an item that was in the shop. So if you guys would like to purchase, just send me a DM on Depop. And I'll change the price to $80 for you. Uh, hi, Kim. How's it going? Pris Trippin's here. How's it hanging? Hope you're doing well. Wait, isn't it your birthday? Oh my gosh, I already forgot. Is today your birthday? Or was it yesterday? Either way, happy birthday, Kim. Everyone say happy birthday to Kim. She's purse tripping right there. She also has a YouTube channel and she sells like handbags also. And she is awesome. So go check her out. But um, 
Ah, the 18th. Okay. Yes. I was off, but happy birthday. Yay. What did you do for your birthday, Kim? Was it good? Tell us. Um, Kelly, yes, the Valentino bag is leather. Oh, uh, yay, everyone's saying happy birthday. Yay, love it. You pulled weeds. <laughs> I was doing gardening work today too, Kim. I was working in the garden. Oh, what did you have for dinner? I hope you ate a lot of delicious food. Like, I, all I want to do is listen, uh, hear about <laughs> Kim's birthday. <laughs> Shogun. Oh, I love that restaurant. Is that, that's the one where they do like, um they like cook the food like in front of you, right? It's almost like, what is it called? Is it not called tapanyaki? But like wherever like the chef is there and they cook in that giant thing in front of you. That's so fun. Oh, I'm glad you had a happy birthday and you had a delicious meal. Come to dinner for this next time. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Hibachi. That's what it's called. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of like a Benihana's. <gasps> oh, my gosh. That is actually... Okay, so at that restaurant, Kim and I actually... I think we live close to each other because we go... I think, like, she... Like, we're, like, neighbors almost, right? And I was actually... We were actually going to that restaurant, like, years ago when my brother was graduating from, like or he was getting promoted from sixth grade to junior high. And we were walking across the street and Snoop Dogg almost ran me over. So it was crazy, but I got to say hi to Snoop Dogg because he almost hit me with his car. But um, it was amazing. Five minutes, are we really five miles away from each other, Kim? That's crazy. Cause I know we go to the same stores, but I can't believe I've never run into you, which is wild. But yeah, <laughs> that's the restaurant that I was almost run over by Snoop Dogg. Oh, Kim, did you know that Snoop Dogg lives in, like, in, like, right here also? Like, he's our neighbor. Um, The high school that I went to, uh, he actually wanted to, like, donate, um, like, something. He was going to donate some sort of, like, money or, like, a, something for the football field. But we had to change the name of the gym to the dog pound. But it was, like, D-O-double-G. And the school didn't want to do that. So then he didn't donate the money. But, like, yeah. That was like a crazy story, but his like um, kids and stuff like went to school here and they played football. But yeah, he's awesome. That's so crazy. Okay, <laughs> sorry you guys, like we're totally like off topic, but that would have been amazing. I want to go to the dog pound, right? And you know what's crazy is that the gym was already called the dog pound, but it was just D-O-G instead of D-O-double-G. Like all they had to do was add an extra G. And then, like, he would have sponsored, like, the new football field bleachers or something. And they didn't. So. You're funny. You must smell the pot from a... <laughs> Bendum. You know what? It's probably true. <laughs> oh, my goodness. No, Kim, it's okay. I'm just glad to hear that you had a beautiful birthday. And i um, glad that you had, like, a... Had a good dinner. But yes, uh, okay. Uh, live, reliving the good old days when Snoop Dogg almost ran me over. But um, up next, we have this really cute Mark by Mark Jacobs crossbody bag. And this one is a double zip pouch, which is super duper cool. No, you're the best, Kim. <laughs> yeah, right. I um, Have you guys watched Snoop Dogg's like cooking or like his show with Martha Stewart? It is so crazy. It's so funny. Like they're like the most unlikely duo, but they're hilarious. Hi, Lisa from Mission Viejo. How's it going? Bendum. Yes. Yeah, see, Bendum watches that show. I love it. But um, okay. So we have this beautiful Mark by Mark Jacobs. Something like flew into my eyeball. And it's a uh, Mark by Mark Jacobs bag, silver hardware. It's a double zip pouch. So it's kind of like the Celine trio, but instead it's like the duo, the Mark by Mark Jacobs duo. 
It has a fun like chain detail here in the front. And both of the pouches are just like open like that. No other compartments in the interior, but this bag is in like new condition. It's beautiful, silver hardware. Lisa, lots of deals in South County. Lisa, I need to go, like, um, I've been to some thrift stores up there, like, towards that area, but Mission Viejo is, like, a lot, like, further. I like their Snoopy collection. <gasps> yes! Did you see it? It's so cute. I just saw it on Instagram. I was really excited. Like, the yellow, um, the yellow one with um, Woodstock is so cute. I love it. Uh, but here we go. Mark by Mark Jacobs. Again, it just has two um zipper compartments no other pockets in the interior but this bag is in like new condition beautiful shape and this one i'm asking 65 dollars if anyone is interested that'll be up in the shop again if you would like to purchase anything just go to the depop shop it's hadrian Dot com, or you can click um, the link down below in the description box, or you can just head over on your Depop app. And this is item number, I think this is item number 11. So what I want to say, item number 11, Mark by Mark Jacobs, double pouch crossbody bag. Um, Tony, the free shipping just happens automatically. So if you purchase anything in the shop, the free shipping is just going to happen as long as it's over $30 or more. Um, or if you um, put multiple items in your shopping cart uh, and that equal $30, it'll also just have free shipping. So it's as long as you're within the U.S., the free shipping will just happen automatically. If you're outside of the U.S., send me a DM and I will give you a shipping quote for how much it'll cost to send to you. Hi, Charlene. How's it going? Sorry, I'm like losing track of what I was doing. Okay, mark by mark, double pouch crossbody bag, gray for $65. So how are you doing, Charlene? How's your night going? Hope you're doing well. Thank you for joining the live sale tonight. Always love having you here. You're welcome, Tony. But yeah, so far, all these items should be up in the shop right now should be shoppable for you guys if anyone is interested my allergies have been going crazy uh oh cat c uh oh you want the jimmy Choo wallet uh shipping in canada okay for the jimmy Choo wallet shipping to canada if you do first class it should be about twenty dollars and then um priority would be thirty Snoop is on The Voice. Is he really on The Voice right now? I'm kind of behind. I am like on the third episode of the Blind Auditions, but I'm getting there. So I didn't know he was... Is he going to be like um, one of like the guest uh, like mentors? Because that would be so cool. And I know, I think um, Ariana Grande is supposed to be a judge next year on The Voice. So that's pretty cool. I love Ariana Grande. I like watched her since she was on... Um, victorious on nickelodeon oh man i love that show that show was so so good and she was literally like my favorite character um but yeah okay what do we have next what do we have up next we did this oh we did this bag oh let's do this okay do you see him with jake paul when jake won the fight no ben no i didn't I didn't, like, watch anything about the Jake Paul fight or anything. I knew he was, like, doing some fight, but I didn't even know that it happened. Um, I found out that it actually happened and that he won during, like, this, like, the live sale on Sunday. I forgot who it was. it you that told me about it? But someone told me about the... Was um, talking about it in the chat. So, <laughs> that's crazy that he won. And it was, like, in one round or it was, like, a knockout. Like, that's crazy. So, Wow. <laughs> okay, up next, we have... Hi, Gina! Oh, yeah, Gina, it was you! Okay, Gina, yes. Gina is, like, a plethora of information. Gina knows everything. She's amazing. Snoop was praising him. <laughs> uh, up next, we have this Jimmy Choo. This is, I believe this is called the Jimmy Choo Reese Wallet Clutch Bag. And this is in, like, this 
beautiful shiny shimmery leather and like fabric combo with a light gold hardware right here at the plaque right there it just shines like a million stars I, you you guys know like i'm like a magpie drawn to anything shiny i saw this one from a mile away i think i was like outside and i saw it through the window and i was like "Ooh, what's that so i just like ran in and saw it inside a consignment store and i grabbed it but this one is gorgeous the interior is like this it has a ton of card slots uh, looks like there's 12 card slots. There's a change pocket right here, the zipper change pocket. And then just like another like pocket back here that you can put your cash. This actually will fit your, uh, your cell phone beautifully. It'll fit right there into the back or you can fit it here in the front. So it'll definitely hold your cell phone, which is always like um, something like that's always awesome to be able to fit like your phone inside a wallet. Uh, so this can be used as a clutch. It can be used as a, a wallet inside your purse. You can even like attach or like just stick a chain through this and wear it as a crossbody strap if you wanted. So lots of different ways to carry this. And the, I think, I believe this wallet clutch retailed for about $800. So um, I'm asking 250 for this um, Jimmy Choo clutch. Isn't it chic, Gina? It's beautiful. How about the Celine belt you found in the bowl? <laughs> I was thinking about just keeping it because it's like such a cool story. So I don't know. if Does anyone want that belt? I was going to actually kind of use it as like a decorative piece. I was literally going to tie up like a stack of books with it and be like, yes, this is the Celine belt that I found at the Goodwill inside a bowl and I'm using it to hold these books together. So, uh, but yes, <laughs> Kelly, right? That's why your name is Kelly Sparkle because you, you love sparkles just like me. I should be Hadrian Sparkle. Um, so this item is item number 12. Right, Taryn? Hi, Taryn. How's it going? Oh, Taryn, I'm so happy you're here. Thank you for joining us tonight. It's Oh, the belt vibe is very this reason. Yes. Luke. Oh, yeah, actually, Hadrian's Wall in England or Europe. Um, there's Emperor Hadrian put it up. He was the emperor during the Pax Romana, the Hundred Years of Peace, and all that stuff. So um, item number 12. And it is currently, actually, right now it is. <laughs> but I, I brought all the bags in here for uh, for the live because I wanted to show you guys a bunch of stuff tonight. So we have the black glitter Jimmy Choo Reese clutch. Um, okay, 250. Oh my gosh, my brain. I'll sit there for a second. Um, that should be up in the shop momentarily. How do you add more than one item in Depop? Tony, um, you can just add, like, just go to each item and then add to cart, and it'll, it should let you do it. Just add each item to the, you can, I think it's just, like, add to cart. It's, like, the button on there. Uh, let me just check really quick. Do, 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 do. Yeah, when you click on buy, it'll just add it to your bag. And then you can just keep adding things to your bag. And then when you check out, it'll just do it all at once for you, um, Tony. Okay, so item number 12 was this black Jimmy Choo Reese clutch right there. It'll be up in the shop in a moment if you guys want to check that out. Reality Life Series. Oh, thank you for following me on Depop. I appreciate it. Thank you. Again, also, everyone that's in the um, that's in the live right now, if you see anything in the shop, let me know. Um, anything that's not in the live right now is already discounted 20%. You'll notice um, the discount. It has like a little yellow tag on the item. Let me actually show you guys what it looks like so you guys know. And uh, if you see that tag, it's already automatically discounted. 20%, they look like this. See those little yellow um, tags on each of the items? And if you see something that has a tag, let me know. 
And um, I'll give you an extra 10% on it. Just send me a DM and my VARI will discount the item an extra 10% off for you. So you'll get a total of 30% off on each item right now during the live. Again, the free shipping is for items $30 or more. And that's going to end on the 23rd. Uh, Cactus Patch Girl, I found a Jimmy Choo bag at a thrift store for 95 but wasn't sure if it was authentic or not. Oh, Cactus Patch Girl. Um, yeah, I see a lot of fake Jimmy Choo bags at the thrift. What I found, though, is that a lot of the fake ones are really bad. I've never seen, like, an actual good fake Jimmy Choo bag. So you can usually tell by the way that um, inside Jimmy Choo usually has, like, a little plaque um, for the bags. And if you can um, remove, like, if you can bend the bracket that's in the back of the of the plaque, if that makes sense, inside the bag, if you can bend it with your finger, then it's definitely a fake. Because um, if it was a real Jimmy Choo, you wouldn't be able to move it at all. That's like the easiest way to check. Uh, Emily, did you see the Black and Asian Culture Festival that happened on George? No, I didn't see that. Though I think I heard people talking about it today. Um, okay, what do we have next? Oh, up next. Okay, how about this? Up next, I have um, a Philip Lim bag right here. This is the Philip Lim, I believe it's the 34 hour bag. And this is beautiful. It's in a black leather. It's stunning with silver hardware. Um, I love this bag so much. It's really cool. You can use it as an overnight bag, as an everyday bag, as a school bag, work bag. The bag opens just like this, like all the way. You can really get into it. And then there's one in here, zipper pocket right here. Um, I think I showed this to you guys once before in a video, and I don't even remember how much I priced it at. So I'm hoping my VA can remember to tell me what it is. We just saw you the conviction. Yes, he was. Yes. Yeah, it's a beautiful bag. Right, April? The Kate Spade purses were so gorgeous. Um, they actually sold already. The Kate Spade... Um, looks like the Kate Spade, the tricolor bag, has sold. As well as the laptop bags. We have some, skate, we have some Kate Spade lovers tonight in the live video and okay so item number i think this is item number 13 and it is the okay item number 13 philip limb black 34 hour uh bag and I'm asking $250 for this one. Yes. Okay. Beautiful. So let me just zip it up again. <laughs> so this is the bag. One more time. Philip Lim, 34-hour bag in black. This one is $250. I always love the G Sword sunglasses. Oh my gosh, Gina. Those sunglasses are everything. Where are they? Where do I where did I put them? Oh, hold on. Let me get them. Hold on one second. They're like, they're literally like up there. Do you guys see it? They are right there. I have a little sunglass thing. <laughs> Gina, if you want it, let me know. I can give you a good discount on it. They've been in the, in the shop forever, but, like, I love them. They're so cool. Like, they're the they're probably, like, the coolest sunglasses I ever will own. And, yeah, they're just so cool. Um, do you have the Tory Burch flats with you? I'm sorry, Laura. I do not have them with me. I have them with um, my shipper. So I don't have them with me at the moment. But did you have a question about them? Uh, can you quickly explain what you mean by saying the red valentine on that tote? What's the red mean? Oh, the luminous hue. It's just um, 
a, a different tier of Valentino, just like how Marc Jacobs has the Marc Jacobs label. They have Mark by Marc Jacobs, Marc Jacobs, New York, or there's like, there's Michael Kors or Michael by Michael Kors. Red Valentino is like a subsidiary of Valentino. So there's like the Valentino is like the most, or the Valentino, Valentino Garavani, and then Red Valentino. So uh, it's just like the name of that like branch of Valentino. And their bags are a little bit cheaper than like the regular Valentino bags, but they're still handmade and in Italy. So that's what's cool about like their line that even though it's still considered like a lower end line from Valentino, their bags are still handmade in Italy. Whew. Yes, it's young, hip and accessible, ready to wear. Thank you, Gina. Um, Cactus Patch 2 Kate Spade aren't as good as when she was still alive and designing. Cactus Patch Girl, you're totally right. Like, um, I feel like the Kate Spade bags have changed a little bit ever since uh actually it was since Coach bought Kate Spade because Co Kate Spade was purchased by Coach a few years ago. And I feel like everything's kind of changed a little bit. And it's uh I feel like the older stuff is so much cooler. Uh oh Emily, thank you for joining Emily. I'll see you later. Um, oh, you're welcome to Luminous You. Yes, tearing it up. Still more affordable, but st you still get that amazing quality and construction, and the materials are still amazing. Like, the leather on that bag is gorgeous. But good night, Emily. Thank you again for joining us. We appreciate you. Um, right, Lisa? Like, I feel like... um. Recently, I feel like Coach, though, has stepped it up, like Coach the brand. Like, their bags have been gorgeous. Um, but Kate Spade, I feel like, I don't know. Like, I haven't seen, um, like, an upturn in, like, any, like, creative design or anything from Kate Spade ever since Coach bought it. So I'm still waiting. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> okay, what do we have next? Is it too late? Like, okay, we're going to go until, like, maybe 11 o'clock uh, because I don't want to keep you guys super, super late. Right, Kelly? I love that coach is doing really, really well. It's stepping it up. The pillow tabby, I am obsessed. Tara, I kind of want one. Like, I want the little one that's like a crossbody. And it would be cute in this yellow because I'm looking at it. But, like, in a yellow like this, I know that, um, that coach has that bag in this yellow color that would be so cool i would love it in this color um uh, hi oh hi roxana in costa rica thank you for joining us yeah that bag was gorgeous lisa you know i haven't seen the cole Haan version i have seen the um target has a lot of those pillow bags now as well those pillow those pillow bags are really really popular and Yellow. Yes, it is my favorite color. <laughs> See, Kim knows. Kim knows me. Yellow is my absolute favorite color. Especially this mustardy color. See, I even have that yellow pillow back there, even though it doesn't match my other pillows. It's like my favorite one. So I always keep it here because it's like my favorite. But love it. The mini one, the purple is gorgeous. You can only get it in Nordstrom right now. Oh, yeah. Sometimes like different uh, like department stores or whatever will have... The um, they'll have only certain colors and we'll carry it only there. Uh, the luminous you need to go to bed as well. Almost two a.m. here. I have to catch the rest tomorrow. Okay, well, thank you so much for joining us, the luminous you. Hopefully, have a good night. Have a good day at work tomorrow. Yes, pillow is fancy. <laughs> thank you, Lisa. I actually got it at the Pottery Barn outlet at a great. I think I got it for like fifteen dollars, like a like a few years ago. So I was really excited to see it there. Uh, there's an emerald green suede. Beady with fringe. So chic. Nina Garcia has one. They are so hard to find. <gasps> I did not know that there was an emerald green suede speedy with fringe. That sounds amazing. Cactus Patch Girl New Coach is really good. There's one near me. <gasps> is there a coach? Yeah, there is actually a coach store near me. Um, I haven't visited an actual coach store in a really, really long time. The last coach store I actually visited was one at an outlet. So I went to like a coach outlet store and it was because i wanted to see the coach disney collection stuff and they are so cute do the newer coach bags have the code yes 
I think it depends on um, the style, but I think the newer ones, like, here, let me show you guys this one. Do, do, do. Oh, no. Okay, things are falling. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Let's do, um, so I know, like, a lot of people think um, that, like, all Kate, like, all coach bags have, ugh, this is, like, a bad example, because you, can, you can't even see it inside this bag, but um, you can see that there's, like, a creed in here, and the creed has, like, that serial number. The first few digits is for the date that it was created and where it was made, and then the other numbers after, that follow it after the dash is the, like, the number that's specific to the bag. Um, not all bags will have that. Some have just like a little like made in little tag or whatever. And then the newer bags actually look like this. So like the tags are totally different and they're no longer like um, how they used to be. Like they changed the font, they changed everything. So it looks totally different. I just bought a Chanel 19. Oh my gosh, Cactus Patch Girl. Congratulations. That is so amazing. I really love those Coach 19 bags. Or Coach, those Chanel 19 bags. They are stunning. I would love, love, love one. Um, probably like in black or brown. It would be so pretty. Like with, um, yeah, I love those bags so much. Congratulations on it. Oh my gosh. If you post any photos on Instagram, you have to tag me because I want to see them. They keep the on the coach act. Yes. Yes, Lisa, you're totally right. Um, I love the coach club. I mean the Kate Spade. You oh yeah. I didn't know Kate Spade did a make uh did a mini mouse collaboration. That's cool. I haven't seen it. I know that like Coach has done a bunch of collaborations with Disney and it's just like yeah, their stuff is so cute. I actually have the medium-sized leather Mickey Mouse from Coach. And I was so excited when I bought it. I should have bought, like, the biggest one that was, like, massive. But it was so expensive. Uh, and this other one was expensive, too. But it's, like, such a piece. Like, it's, like, a piece of art. And it just sits inside the library. And I love it. Uh, I think they should still be some on their surprise. Order. <gasps> I'm going to have to check it out. Love by love. I want to see it. That's so cool. Okay. Um, so back to <laughs> the Harvey's Disney collection is nice too. <gasps> is that the seatbelt bags? Is that the, that Harvey's? I haven't seen them. Oh, thank you, Cactus Patch Girl. I appreciate you so much. I'm so glad you enjoyed the videos. I love doing these lives with you guys, too. They are so much fun. Like, I I love it. So, um, but if you guys have any questions, too, about any more, any of the bags, again, just let me know. Everything should be live in the shop right now. I think we're all caught up with everything. Uh Right, Mimi? I feel like we should all get matching Chanel 19 bags. It would be so cute. We would be, like, the most adorable wearing our little bags together. <laughs> I live in Santa Ana where the flag store is. Oh, Lisa, I love that store. It's the good. It's the Goodwill Marketplace location. If you guys haven't been to that one or um, are planning to be in the area, uh, the that Goodwill is... So cool. It has three different stores. It has the Goodwill Marketplace, which is the outlet. And they also hold auctions there. You can buy like these giant like pallets full of stuff. Um, they also have the Goodwill Computer Works store where you can buy all sorts of technology from computers, TVs, VCRs, monitors, video games. They sell it all. And then they have the regular Goodwill store, which is massive. It's one of the biggest stores in Orange County, and they have so much product. Like, it's crazy. You can spend, like, a whole, whole day there. So it's it would be so much fun. But purse tripping, can we please get matching bags? Like, we can be little twinsies. <laughs> that would be so fun. Uh, Kelly Sparkle, it would be so cute. Yes, 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 yes. We would be so, we would be the cutest. Okay, um, getting sidetracked with the Chanel bags. <laughs> oh, I didn't even show you guys this bag. Okay, so I think I showed you guys this bag before, but this one is currently in the shop. This one is $68. But um, 
for you guys right now, if you guys are interested in this, this one will be 50. So just message me on Depop. Let me know. Um, if this is the yellow. This is item number 14. Am I number 14? I've talked so much that I can't even see the numbers anymore. Yeah, item number 14. Item number 14. Yellow. Rebecca Minka felt bag. And we're going to do $50 if anyone is interested. Ooh, the white in 26. Wow. That's good. That's beautiful. Fox 10 Mulder, bye, Henry. Gotta run. Have a nice evening. See you in the next episode. Oh, bye, Fox 10 Mulder 13. Thank you for joining us. I appreciate you. Thank you for being here today. Oh. Uh, Man, I would love, I love white handbags. I feel like a lot of people are scared of like colored bags and I'm like, bring it on. I love them. I just love like the pop that they give to like any outfit and it's just like gorgeous. Love it. So congratulations on your bag. I'm so excited for you, Cactus Patch Girl. That's so cool. Um, all right, what do we have next? Oh wait, it's almost 11 o'clock. Okay. Um, so we did this. Let's do another Rebecca Minkoff bag because I love this purple one, which I don't know if this is actually in the shop yet. Is it in the shop yet? Um, so this next one is this beautiful purple Rebecca Minkoff. This is the Mini Mac in the smooth, um, well, it's kind of like a smoother grain. Uh, plum color with gold hardware. Le love this bag. You can double up the crossbody straps on the sides like this. So it becomes a shoulder bag or you can extend it all the way. It becomes a crossbody bag. We have these super fun tassels on the zipper pulls. We have a pocket right here in the front underneath the iconic buckle. I was able to... Oh, congratulations, April. That's awesome. Right, Kelly? This one's really pretty. Um, this one I'm asking uh, $60 shipped for this one. The interior has the butterfly print, which I think is so pretty. I love the butterfly print um, for the fabric. And there's just like one interior card pocket inside. The yellow handbag, right? Isn't it pretty? This is um, a belt bag. Cactus Patch Girl. And you can wear it kind of like a crossbody bag as well. It would be really cool to just carry like across your chest like that. And, but yeah, so this Rebecca Minkoff, it's in great, great shape. There's just a little bit of um, rubbing, like primarily at these bottom corners right there. But other than that, the bag is in fantastic condition. The color is gorgeous. And this is um, item number, I believe it's item number 15. And this is the plum colored Rebecca Minkoff. Uh, mini Mac crossbody, and we're gonna do sixty dollars shipped. Alrighty, okay. So last look at this one before we go over to the next one. Great color, grape. Oh yeah, we should call this grape. Is it more grape or more plum? Is like a deeper color, huh? So maybe this is a grape. Mm, I love grapes. Okay. Uh, oh, speaking of, like, fruit, we made chocolate-covered strawberries tonight, and it was so delicious. Oh, my gosh. Like, the strawberries, we got them from Trader Joe's, and they were so sweet. And I'm actually going to show you guys a photo of the <laughs> chocolate-covered strawberries from tonight's dinner, because they were so, so good. Yum! Chocolate-covered covered strawberries. Uh, best thing I thrifted was a pair of black Louboutins in my size. Now just try and win. <gasps> Ooh, are they like the super high stiletto heels, Cactus Patch Girl? I don't know how you amazing people can walk in heels because I can barely walk on my feet. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> I can barely walk in a straight line sometimes. So that's awesome. Uh... <clears throat> Right, Cactus Patch Girl? That case paid behind you made me want to have some melon with tajin. Ooh, yes, melon with tajin. That sounds so good. 
Koi Pond. How many Tustin Ranch neighbor lets two Pancit and Adobo? <gasps> oh, I love Pancit and Adobo. We actually just had Adobo the other night. Mom made Adobo chicken, and it's so good. I think the way she makes it is like a little bit different though than like the standard Filipino um, Adobo, but it's so delicious. I love it. We should do like a cooking video on uh mom's adobo recipe because it's so different from any other adobo i've ever tried and it's so good um okay um up next Ooh, it's almost time over okay it's almost 11 o'clock i wanted to end by 11 because i didn't want to keep you guys for too late but we're definitely going to be doing another live very soon i'm going to try to do it later on, or earlier on in the day because I know these are so late, so I apologize profusely. Um, but this one I've showed you guys in the past before, too. But this is a beautiful Rebecca Minkoff metallic laptop bag. This one is for the 13-inch MacBook Pro uh, or Pro size. It's gorgeous. It's in, like, new condition. It's, like, this distressed metallic. Uh, it's, like, a bronze or bronze color, I think, is what you would call it. Um, it has, like, the little... Tassels on the zipper pulls or the front zipper pocket interior looks like this. It still has like the additional like or the original shaper of the bag. And this bag has like really nicely padded as well. And you can actually remove the crossbody uh, strap, which is really nice. And you can use it just as a laptop sleeve. Yes, for cooking video. Yay, Kelly. Junior Maravilla, they just had pancit with Dinuguan toppings. <gasps> well, I haven't had Dinuguan toppings before. Uh, grape and berries bag, yes. April foot weather in Michigan has been odd too. Yeah, I feel like everywhere, like everywhere, like I hear like people all over the country just like having strange weather. Like it's so weird. Uh, but how much was this? I showed you guys this bag before. How much was it? Oh, 50. Sorry, I was asking my VA in my ear. Your mom's food looks so good. Thank you, Cactus Patch Girl. I wish we could, like, open up, like, a weekend restaurant or something so people, like, that want to try her food could come and taste it because her food is so, 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 so good. And, uh, yes. Wouldn't that be cool to do, like, something like that? I think that would be amazing. Like, once the world opens back up again, we should try to do something like that. It would be, like, so cool. But item number 16 is Metallic... Rebecca Minkoff laptop bag, 13 inch. Oh, how much was it again? I totally forgot. $50. Okay. 13 inch. Yes. Um, such a gorgeous color, right? It's beautiful. I love it. Such a cool colored laptop bag. Uh, ooh, Lisa, my daughter and I love watching your videos, Hayden. You're always so sweet and positive. Thank you so much, Lisa. And say hi to your daughter for me. Uh, Laura, I would so, right, Laura? Oh my gosh. Like, honestly, it's amazing. Oh, I feel like my allergies are going crazy. So I am sorry if I sound like super allergy ridden um oh it's gonna be 11 and one in once in one minute so that is gonna be the end of today's live sale thank you guys again so much for joining um we're gonna have all the bags available uh in the shop all the prices are already there everything's already there um so if you guys have any questions about anything feel free to dm me on depop or send an email or DM me on Instagram. And if you guys would like to purchase any of the other items in the shop, I'm offering you guys 10%. If you guys were in this live chat, just message me and I'll discount it for you. Again, free shipping uh, on orders $30 or more is going to end on April 23rd. So go check it out, take advantage. And thank you guys again so much for hanging out tonight. Again, it was so much fun having this live sale with all of you. I appreciate you all so much. I'll see you guys uh, later on this week. Hopefully the next live will be a little bit earlier. I'm trying to do it earlier for our East Coast people, but I love you guys immensely. And uh, thank you again. Bye, guys. Bye, Kim.